What is going on everyone? This is Rossi and welcome to another Retro FIFA here today. Now this one is pretty awesome, it's pretty different. You've, you guys have asked for this, but I want to talk about one or two things first. Obviously in the comment section of the previous video, um, the Full Legends one, which did really well by the way, got over like 7,000 likes, which was obviously astonishing. Um, but a lot of you are saying like, what's the point of this? I don't get this and stuff like that. So um, the pure basis of it was, and um, this video as well, is just, it's literally a bit of fun. It's just interesting, look back on some older cards and just uh, if you had the choice, which, one was, which ones would you you pick it's literally as simple as that it's a bit of fun and people are saying it's pointless and um so i guess some of the some of the parts that i probably agree with but the fact that a lot of people are liking the video and uh it's you know showing a lot of support like i like i say over seven thousand likes in the previous episode um just shows to me that you guys actually are enjoying it even if the minority aren't but the majority are and that's who i'm going to be pleasing today if you're looking to buy any custom controllers make sure you check out get grip in the description down below use code rossi to check out page for a nice a five percent discount so today we've got some pro and form cards which are some pretty awesome cards that only professional footballers get. Um, all the stats are quite similar, 95 rated cards and stuff. So what we're going to be doing is picking the, you know, it's going to be really tight margins about which cards we're going to pick. But I want you guys to join me along with this one today. In the comment section down below, I want you to pick your teams as I'm picking them as well. Um, so, you know, which goalkeeper to put, you post a comment saying this goalkeeper, which left back, you post a comment saying that left back. You know, it's as simple as that. This, this do it together. And as always, if you do enjoy this video, like the previous one, over 7,000 likes, make sure to drop a thumbs up and a like down below. If if we do get anywhere near that same number again, I'll bring you guys maybe like a full um, silver. I mean, some of the Brazilvers like Giovanni days and stuff like that. Um, it's like FIFA 10 foot draft silvers. So some of the best ever silver cards you're ever going to see. Could we see something like that? Just drop a like and I'll bring it to you. All right then. So the goalkeeper. Okay. All right. Does someone want to explain to me what happened to Horn stats? Does someone want to explain to me what is that? I mean, the guy's name's Horn, which we're not going to talk about too much. Uh, but the stats, I mean, it's a really tough choice between him and the rest of them. So receive out of Vorm and Howard. So as we know, Vorm and Howard, Howard's been on a lot of EA stuff um, throughout the years. He's got his own pro and form card, which you guys can play online. You can't play with it, but you can play against it um, because only he has it. So we're looking at two very tight stats, all right? So Vorm's got better diving, better handling for um, Howard, better kicking Howard has, better reflexes. Better speed and or oh, just I mean I'm gonna have to go for Howard in this one. I think he's just got a little bit of better stats that just edge it from Vaughn. Going into the left back position now, obviously with this is a retro one to so the R stuff from previous games, Taylor and uh, Enrique obviously from previous defers as well. I mean all from previous, but Smith, never seen this one before, never never really knew about it. Liverpool left back. Baines, obviously amazing. Taylor, I mean, I knew he was a big FIFA fan. Enrique and Shaw. Now, I mean, I just I knew Enrique was a massive FIFA fan as well. But look at these stats. If you just look at them across the board. Um, so they've all got 90, okay, 95 pace. I'm going to narrow it down to pace. So three of them are 95. That's great. Baines got better dribbling, but same defending as Shaw. Better shooting. Oh, I mean, I mean, I think it's between Baines and Shaw. But for me, I'm going to go for Shaw because... I mean, he got injured. I feel so sorry for him. So, I feel bad for him. Let's put him in the team. Seller back, back cards. What the fuck is Jones doing? I'm not sure what Phil Jones is doing in his card picture. But he does have a pro and form card, which is in the game usually. But this one, this picture is a little bit different. Let's go. I heard a rumor he spent £40,000 on FIFA 14 packs. Like, £40,000 I heard he spent a rumor on. So, I know he's a big FIFA fan. And EA have actually really hooked him up with his stats. I mean, look at his dribbling compared to the rest of them. 87. He's got better defense. Oh, actually, no, that, that, that guy over there, mate. Della Garazzo, whatever. He's, he's got a better defending, but better physical than pretty much all of them but Jones. Um, passing is all right. Shooting's decent. I mean, pace is 95 is the best as well. I'm going to have to go for Julian Lescott, the 40 grand boy. All right, then let, next up, centre backs then. Bruno, I've actually played against on FIFA. I played against him. He's actually a nice guy. He's now retired, unfortunately. So this is his card last year. Um, his ankle was shot to bits or something like he said to me. So Rio Ferdinand over there as well. Keen, I think he X-Man United as well. Um, Jesus, I mean, he's pretty good stats. And that Milosevic, I mean, I don't really know about this geezer, but... Alright, let's have a look at the rest of the stats then. Okay, I think I'm going to mix it up. Okay, I, I thought about Rio Ferdinand because the 99 defender, 97 headed, but I'm going to go for Jesus actually. This is a, that's a bit of a wild choice, I think. Right back cards then. Okay, piss check. You might want to check out your stats, mate, because they are shit. Danse, never actually even heard of this guy, to be honest. Yedlin, um, I mean, stats of what a what? A 98 pace. Are you kidding me? 98 pace EA gave him on his pro card. Um, to be fair, Gaddis has got 97 as well, and Rio Ferdinand, what a wild Rio. I mean, I think it just wants me to pick Rio, doesn't it? 
But I'm going to go for Yedlin. What a guy. He's got like four star skills as well, I think. Going for the right mid position. And as you guys know, I have uh, did a video on Nasri's card last year. Um, it was pretty awesome. We played against the you know, full Legends team and stuff like that. Uh, pretty good card in this one. We've got Routledge, Peterson, Johnson, and... Um, bah Bahui, I admit, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Rowledge got the most pace, uh, he's got pretty much the best dribbling, you know, behind Pettersson. Um, shooting's up there. Um, I mean, I'm going to go for Routledge, the oldest card in this one. First set of mids then, as you guys are aware, I actually, I actually have used Joey Button's card before. Um, he gave it to his younger brother and his brother sold it in the market. This is a few years ago. Doran's card is looking pretty good. I might have to go for that one, I think. Uh, Mason's card's good. Feather, I think I just... You know, messed that one up completely. But Cahill, obviously, big FIFA fan, big EA fan as well. He's worked with in the past. But for this one, I think I'm going to have to go for... I mean, I, it's tough. I think I'm going to have to go for Joey Barton because, in the end of the day, I've used him. So, past experience, and I know he's amazing. And there's a video probably on my channel of me actually using him. If you guys want to check it out, he's awesome. Next up, we've got some great suggestions. Oh, mate, you can't put Matuidi and Torre in the same selection. That is... That's an arm breaker. Carroll, um, I don't know if... I, I've heard of him before, but I don't know if he's still at Tottenham. Thompson, never heard of him. Guthrie, I've heard of. Was a massive FIFA fan back in the day. Guthrie was. Got pretty good dribbling, actually. Best out of all of them. But for me, my choice is, is pretty simple. I think I'm going to go for Yaya Torre because not a single stat is below 89. I mean, I know others are pretty good, like Matuidi's. Mate, Matuidi ain't got one below 90. I should have gone for Matuidi, but I'm going to go for Torre. Left mids then. Okay. Balassi card. Look at this guy's Balassi card. Had one in previous FIFAs. Probably got one now. Uh, Bale, Hazard, Griezmann, and Amiobi. Okay, so four. I mean, uh, Amiobi's up there with Hazard and stuff like that, surely. But, um, you know, uh, uh, this is a real tricky one. This is a real tricky one. But, I'm going to go for the quickest player on this one. I'm going to go for Bale because, I mean, Gareth Bale. Lads, you've got to pick Gareth Bale, and you? Let's be honest. You've got to do it. Strikers then. We've got Fondra, who was actually a massive FIFA fan as well. Serki, uh, Aguanahor, Johnson, and Ben. I think Johnson's now retired or retiring, he's just announced. Um, Aguanahor, I mean that pace. I'm going to have to do it. I'm going to have to pick the quickest player and the sweatiest player I pro possibly can. Um, I'm, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for Bond. I'm sorry. And then next up, some absolutely fantastic choices. Williams, I think. Uh, I'm not sure who plays for him now. Does he play for like not not an Forest? No, not County or something. Like that. I saw that day. Uh, Benteke, I can Fenwa, Gignac, and Fletcher. Now, I mean, I can Fenwa's stats. I mean, they're amazing. But he's not gonna link up with my boys, is he? So. Gignac, you're in Mexico now, but that's your old card. I'm going to go for Benteke. That's it. Bon Lahore, Benteke, link up, Aston Villa. I mean, obviously, he's now at Liverpool, but, I mean, we're talking that that's that pure sweat. So here's the team, guys. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure you do drop a like down below for something pretty interesting, pretty fun and different. Make sure you drop a like, drop a comment, subscribe for more of these foot drafts here on my channel. And, uh, yeah, we'll take it easy and peace.